Excuse me. Good morning, sir. Have I seen you before? No, sir. I just started work this morning. If you must work here, then you have to learn to come on time. Okay, sir. Okay. Understand? Okay, sir. Tony, yes, I'll come right over here. As you can see, I'm no longer getting younger. Age is no more on my side. If there is anything I know I have done for you, is to give you the best of education, to prepare you for the future, for tomorrow, for the challenges ahead. And I want to believe that you are competent to continue from where I stopped. More so with your experience as a manager in this company. You should be able to run the affairs of this empire, business empire I have built over the years on a daily basis to a successful end. Remember, Tony, you are my heir apparent. Father, I am very grateful. And I promise you that I will run the business successfully. Like you have just said, I'm very grateful for giving me the opportunity to prove myself as a man. I think I'm happy now. I can now go back and sleep with my two eyes closed. Instead of the usual one eye open, one eye closed. Because I have been thinking about this over the years. Even if I'm to die now, I will die a happy man. Because I'm sure that I have somebody who is competent to continue from where I stopped. So, my dear. I'm very grateful, sir. You are my son and you remain one. Okay? Um, as time goes on, I will let you into the other things. Sir, I come from far away. Where? Alagbadu. Alagbadu. That seems like the outskirts of Lagos, right? That's the only place I can get accommodation now. And then if you have to work in this office, you have to get a place nearer. Understand? Okay, sir. Finish up on time. I need to use the office. Okay, sir. Miss Mary. Anyang. Anyang, yes. You've been working here for quite a long time, right? Well, you've been found to be intelligent, diligent, and hardworking. Besides, I went through your credentials and found out that you have a very impressive SSE results. And with your vast knowledge in the computer, the company has decided to promote you to the post of a receptionist. Thank you. 
Thank you very much, sir. Thank oh, no, you come very on. much, sir. Sit up. This is your letter. Thank you very much, sir. I'm very grateful, sir. This is your office. Sit up. Sit up. Come on, sit down. Congrats once again. Thank you very much, sir. Sit down. So you can resume work immediately. Then that's no problem. Whenever your parents are in town, they can put up in the main building. Besides, if you want to move into the main building, it's okay by me. But I need to have my own place. You see, Mary, I can't afford to lose you. You've taken very good care of me, cooked very good meals for me. Look, Mary, I need someone like you by my side. You see, Mary, please, will you be there for me? Talk to me. Thank you. operate like that here. Even we that we're employed. We're employed by a consulting firm.
don't just walk into this workshop and think that anytime you call me, I'll give you money. No, no, I don't have. Take. Charlie, take off your shirt and join me if you want to walk. You are going home again. Mary, please. Has it, what are you waiting for? Will you move this car? I said, move Mary, the car. Mary, please, oh my God. Lava, wait, you wait. Mary, forgive me. Has it moved this car? Hi, Mary, forgive me, please. For oh, Lava, wait, you wait. I'm sorry, go. said so many good and big things about you. <laughs> and I must confess, what a wonderful and perfect husband you've been to my sister. I must say you've been taking proper care of her. God, she looks every inch a supermodel. Yeah, you can say it. Oh, uh -huh, no, I'm not fine. I've tickled you. <laughs> Just look at her. Anyway, thanks for the compliments. <laughs> you look drop dead gorgeous. Thank you. You can't believe it. I have gone all around town looking for you before. I went to the new house you said you paid for and I practically saw total strangers there. Then I had to run down to um, our former place. That was where I met uh, Mama I Nadia. She was the one who told me that you people lived here. And guess what? She was telling me, you know, Mary, your sister now is now married. I said, yes, I know. <laughs> Says mamas, everybody. Well, Papa is dead. Charles is still missing. Mama and 
Ajoma are in the village. She is trying to get over Papa's death. She insists on your return before she proceeds the funeral. She's greatly worried about Charles. What, what, what do you mean Charles is still missing? James gave Charles some money to take to Papa and Mama. Uh -huh. But he has not gotten home since then. And you mean he's not in the village? <sighs> I went round with Tony to police stations, mortuaries, hospitals, yet there is no trace of Charles. Charles, my brother. Charles, my brother. So what about, what about James? Edwin told me of all the atrocities he had been committing. James squandered everything. I saw him some days back and he was asking for forgiveness. Well, I, I, didn't, I didn't look at him, I didn't, I didn't care, I didn't want to see him. Where does he stay now? I don't know and I don't care. Darling, please. You're being too hard on him. James has realized his mistakes. Please and please forgive and forget. Stanley, could you please explain to her? She should forgive him. down by uh, a hit and run car and presently he is in the hospital and he insists I should come and see you. Well tell him that I don't care and I don't want to see him. I don't give a damn about him. Look, where, where exactly did you say he was? Presently he is in Gateway Hospital. I took him there myself, sir. Please take me there. Take us there. Brother, I said I don't want to see him. Mary. Devil. Oh, God. 
I didn't know what came over me, please. Oh my God, I'm supposed to die, God. No, 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 it's okay. It's okay, it's okay. James. It's okay. James, it's all right. It's all right. I didn't know mm. why I was so wicked to my own flesh and blood. James, 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 it's, oh. it's okay. It's okay. Oh, I, it's, I don't know why I'm leaving now. It's God. okay. Better forgive me, James, please. James, it's okay. It's okay. So, now where, where, where's Charles? Where's Charles? with your evil and devilish plots. But my God supersedes you. I thought I have a brother. Never knew I was living with a devil and can it. That's my brother. James, you think you could just walk away like that? There's always a payback time. And this is the Look, 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 I swear look, you must be Look, back. look. I, Charles, he has not gotten to this yet. I, I don't know. I don't, I don't know what's happening. Tony, what's going on? This murderer! That's what he is. Look, the man lying down there is your brother, your twin brother. That family is not my brother! This evil says of assassins to come and kill me on my way to the... Mama, you see this money and they use it for the cow and my own share for you. Please, please, come on, keep quiet. Come on, get James to send out this message. You know here when he talks, eh? After this one, he gets many jobs where he will give us. You know here, I'm... Drop that door now. Drop that door. Doctor, yes. What really is the problem? His legs need to be dislocated. Ah. Is he going to be all right? Definitely, he'll be all right. I'm assuring you that he'll be all right. Sorry, eh? Mm. Mm. Take it easy. No, he still won't care.
God forgives us when we go against him. Look, it is obvious that he is regretting all his actions. He's not regretting anything. Of course he is. He doesn't regret anything, I know. Mary, do you think your father, if he was alive, would be happy seeing you fight each other like this? You think so? Honey, you don't understand. You your husband is talking. Listen to your husband. Your husband is talking and you have the effrontery to talk back. Were you brought up that way? Behave yourself. Now I want all this to cease at once, here and now. What's wrong? Do you know Papa will turn in his grave for all these things you people are doing? My father will turn in his grave. That's the point. You want to kill Mama? You want to kill Mama? Please don't kill my mother for me. I beg you people in the name of God. Please! Don't kill my mother for me. What will she do if she hears this? It's alright. It's alright. Every family has its secrets. If someone said that all lizards die on their stomach, you don't know which has a stomach ache. Must it be our own that they will hear? Every time they hear our family on the streets. Let's learn to hang our dirty linens in our bedrooms. Why can't we resolve all this? Why? Why, Charles? Why all this enmity? Your husband is talking to you, forgive. If he wouldn't listen to your husband, who else would you listen to? Look, if you will continue this, I will turn my back like I've never known you and I will walk out! That's alright, you that's alright. Look, I think the most important thing to do right now is for us to all go back to the village and see Mama and Choma. Let's fix the date for, for that journey. I can't wait to see Mama as well, because I'm sure she would have worried herself to death now. I'm also anxious to go and see my mother-in-law. Of course, we need to see her. You see, when we get to the village, I will take you around the village. Well, honey, let me go and check on this.
for fertilizer in this country, as I'm talking to you. And let me tell you, as soon as the sheep docks, we're going to sell all of them. And I tell you, we're going to make twice the money we put in it. You see, I am not faulting the arithmetic. It's quite viable, but then a hundred million naira is quite a huge amount of money. Oh, Mr. Tuni, you want to tell me that the bank cannot grant you this facility, this little facility? No, no, that's not the point. The most I've asked from the bank is 20 million naira. Oh, there you go again. Just look at it. What is the difference? 20 million naira and 20 million naira and 100 million naira. I mean, there's nothing in it. See, a loan is a loan. Thank God that we're going to pay the same interest rate and for the same 90 days period. I mean, there's nothing to worry about it. Just look at it. Look at it very, very well. Okay, James, um, let me sleep over it. By tomorrow, I can be able to decide. Okay, if you say so, let me not bother you much. You want? Okay. All right. So, me tomorrow. No problem. Take care of yourself, okay? Take care. Honey, whatever skin we are scooped up. Please don't do it. Mary. Mary, when will you ever forgive your brother? Look, James is your blood brother. I've told you. I have forgiven him, but I've neither forgotten nor trust him. Honey, what does he want? Well, he's proposing a business deal and I think it's okay. Don't do it. You see, I have checked it and there's no way I fault it. Besides, he's not touching the money. You see, he's only touching the profit and that has to be after the business has materialized. Still don't do it. Honey, I will not let your apathy make me pass on a good deal. This is business, you have to understand. Since I cannot convince any of you about him, honey, please, whatever you want to do, let it be in the office. I don't like seeing him around, please. If that is how you want it, then let it be. Thank you. Um, how did the visa go? Well, I just hope it passes through, because Stanley's coming back was a mistake. And there's no way he could have ignored Papa's funeral. He's the first son, and our tradition demands that he returns. I just hope he gets this visa. I really hope so. Let's hope so. Well, honey, let me go prepare dinner. You ready, sir? 
Mary and James. As I was saying, I know very soon now you leave us and go back to abroad. You know, I I really can't wait to get back to, to the U.S. Exactly. I mean, after leaving the U.S. for some time, I, I really find it very difficult to adjust to the Niger system here. Yeah. I understand. It's always like that. But you don't need to bother yourself over that. <laughs> Before I forget, bro, Stanley, when you get there this time around, don't forget to supply me with good clothes for my boutique, you know, for my business. I need it. I'm thinking of how to start importing um, uh, fairly used cars from the U.S. for you. Cars? Yes. They seem to be very expensive here, and they're quite cheap over there. The I'm talking of my business. I don't say cars. So the cars is business, too. Oh, OK. Cars, clothes. Cars, clothes, whatever. Mm -hmm. Hey. James, James. James. Oh. James, how are you? I'm cool. So, Alpha, uh, how was the meeting? Yeah, it was, it was all right. He has to take over it. In fact, there's no problem. Wow. Mm. It's too good to miss. Thank God. That's a good one. I'm telling you. Mm. It's all right. I believe very soon this family will become billionaire brothers. Ooh, the billionaire, billionaire brothers. brothers. <laughs> I can't wait to put a big smile on Mama's face. You need it. Mama deserves it. Oh, my God. Those billionaire brothers. Mm. Have you eaten something? No, oh, let me go to the kitchen. Hey, you need it. You're yeah, looking so down and out. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He said I should wait for another three weeks. Three weeks? Don't do Jamie now. Three weeks is too long for you. You need to be in America in the next three days. Look, I have to go in there and talk to you. No, it's okay, it's okay. Let's not cause a scene here. They will begin to think because you are you are so 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 person's son. That's why we are trying to take the law into your hands. Um, maybe maybe don't you think we should talk to your father to talk to them? Okay, maybe we have to do that. Or should I talk to Mr. Omar Gotip? I just can't get a simple visa stamped. I mean, it was so easy the first time. I wonder why it's becoming so difficult. Wait, Stanley, I've been wanting to ask you this question. Does it mean if you don't go abroad, there's nothing you can do here? Tony, even if there was something I could do. Tony, where do I get the capital from? Where do I get the money to do that kind of business? Or is it... Indulging in this 50, 50,000 naira business at the end of the day. One's expenses is, 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 I mean, guzzles the whole profit you make. Okay, now, sit back and think of a business you can do with two million naira. Yes? <laughs> no. Tony, no, 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 no. No, not coming from you. I mean, we can't keep doing this. You, you established my, my, my kid brother in business, opened a boutique for him, he's doing well, and then you're married to my younger sister. Gave her a life she never could have dreamt of in her wildest dream. And now here I am, expecting to get some money from you. Tony, I, I'm, I'm choking you guys up. It's not, it's not proper. Stanley, Stanley, why are you talking like that? What are we friends for? You see, the money I'm giving you is part of a profit. I got from the business your brother brought to me. Besides, if you're not convinced, let, let's, let's put it this way then. Uh, I'm going to give you some loan. We're going to sign an agreement and ask for an interest like the bank does and you're loaning money from Tony International Bank. That's it. Tony, you. Yeah. Just oh, impossible. Less. Impossible. <laughs> that's, that's what you are. <laughs>
It's in your hand. Even without that, you still have my blessings. You have contributed tremendously to the progress of this village. Igwe, I salute you. It is true that no matter how big a tree might grow, it still rests on the soil. So, no matter how little I have achieved, I owe it to you, Igwe, and to the entire village who have supported and encouraged my father before his death. And now me, Igwe. My son, you have spoken well. You have spoken well, my son. You have spoken well. What I will do, when the Council of Elders meet, I shall bring up the matter and we'll talk it over. Igwe, I thank you. I thank you very much. agreed to extend me a hundred million naira loan facility. Yes! <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you very, very much. Oh my God. You're really a very good businessman. All you needed was a chance. You see, that's why I told people that I was born to be a billionaire. <laughs> but they don't take me serious. That is why when it comes to counting of hundreds and thousands, I find it very difficult. But when it comes to counting of millions, my brain becomes very, very active. <laughs> <laughs> then I should be calling you a billionaire. Ah, I love that name, billionaire. <laughs> Honestly. Okay, let's get started with the paperwork. I'll get my lawyer to do the right things. I think you should get your people to, to, to get started. No, no problem, just the way you like it. Okay? Let's do it pretty fast. I'm gonna call my lawyer to do some necessary silence and the documentation, including paperwork. Do you understand me? Oh my god. I'm busy. Oh, no problem. Thank you. Oh my god. Thank you very, very much. You're welcome. Bros, by this time next month, I will be a multi millionaire. Amen. You see, after buying my chip and my house, I am going to take a chieftaincy title. Chieftaincy title? Hmm? What for? What well, I say, if you want to be a millionaire, you think like a millionaire. <laughs> so, what has chieftaincy title got to do with a uh, millionaire? All the millionaires in Nigeria, all of them are chief Tessie title holders. The only person I know that is a millionaire, in fact, in this world, that's not a chief, is only because of America, and that is because he is not a Nigerian. Hmm. So, isn't that a whole lot of bother to you? Doesn't he bother you? He doesn't. Well, let me tell you this. And I'm telling you this because you are my brother. No matter how much money you have in this world, if you're not a chief, your power is limited. Except if you're in a place of authority where you have put money and power. That is it. <clears throat> brother, hmm? I hope this your dream will not get you into trouble. Be careful. And that's for the last time. Once beaten twice shy, I have adopted a new method. And my rule number one says, I should be aware of women. I should keep away from women and gambling. Not just, not just gambling for the sake of gambling. Do you understand me? You still gamble? Well, for her stakes, my brother. For her stakes. Oh, my God. 
Well, you won't understand. Bros, I want to be at the top. I want to be at the peak. I want to be there. Or you won't understand. But I'll tell you. When I come back, I will tell you more. But meanwhile, very soon, be here. Pim, pim, po. Pim, po. No more. Pa, pa, pa. Positive way. Amen. May God really help you. So I can see you are turning back to your own behavior. Cheers. Thank you very much. Oh. How is Stanley? Fine, how is fine? Chief, I can't believe I'm seeing you. It's nice meeting you. Ah, you're welcome. It's a long time. A long time. James, huh? is that all you can say? What else do you want from me? Don't you know him? Yes, I know him. This is one of the most illustrious sons of our community. Chief from Basi Weekend. Great to work. You see, when you talk like that, I get embarrassed. Ah, uh, no, no, Chief, don't get embarrassed. You see, you don't need to get embarrassed with someone's feet. So, what are you doing in town? Uh, actually, I came for a photo shoot. Okay. I'm seeking for a seat in our constituency in the House of Assemblies. You're contesting? Yes. <laughs> That's nice. <laughs> Chief, you will win. In fact, you will come on the post. I hope so. Yes. I really hope so. You will win. I hope to get the chance to serve our people. You will? Serve the people you mean? I beg your pardon, James. <laughs> you heard me the first time. <laughs> Chief, he's joking. I, I know him. Brother, this is not a joke. This is an insult. You can call it whatever you like. I am not deceived. You want to be insulted so you can bleed the entire community. It won't happen. And who will stop me? I will stop you. James. It's a walkover. Chief. OK, let's see who will laugh last. Chief. Come back. What are you embarrassing him? What do you mean? Are you mad? What do you mean by chief, chief, chief? Chief what? Chief my foot. Sit down there, man. Yes, team. Oh, yeah, shake the team. Damn. It's a fear star like never before. Or a ball left. But how you didn't feel the team? The club get more. Make you join the way to unforget your stress. Don't join the heat. We could be right now. No stand the back. Find somebody who can feel the heat. Make the fever come on. Dance with me. We go rock to dawn. Check the flow. Everything done. The groove. Make a grab again. I won't feel myself. No dumb. Me girl. Now the time it is. Let's party. Check one, two, yeah, this is around you. Funky D, you make deep. On the musical wheel, so just chill. Cause you know we got the real deal. The big deal, spending million naira bill. Spitting lyrics through your eardrum. I've been on murder, big robbers, cause I'm almost with a spare gun, y'all. I'm never cold, almost hot when I spit. My style so bitter makes you wanna permit. But it's a dance track, and I'm down with my nizzle. We about to hit the dance track, that's how we do. Nobody it better than me. Drop your rap to the fullest, make you bounce like a doesn't make sense. I mean, if it were to be robbers, they would have taken something. According to the police, they said they suspected they were probably cop snatches. Maybe my, my brother-in-law recognized one of them. That's why they shot at him. Poor Mary, so sad. It's really sad to be a widow 
just barely one year of being married. I don't know what I would call it, ill luck or what. Just now, when we think that the storm is over. <sighs> you all must take heart. You have to console her. She needs you people now. You have to be strong. Please. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. I really don't know anything about his business. I... It's okay, madam. As the case stands, even as a present, your husband is indebted to the bank to the tune of 120 million naira. What? Huh? What, 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 what are you saying? You see, there's no need for you to fear. This is just a fact I'm accustomed to. You see, he did a business, and I must say it went well. In a few days from now, you should be solvent. That is, the loans would have been paid off. Thank God. Parimari, sir, you, you almost gave me a heart attack. 120 million naira? Yeah. That's some money, you know. And, and you say you don't know exactly when the money will be paid. Um, is that to say you, you will keep us posted? Uh, actually, I wasn't the one that drew up that deal. Your brother actually arranged the deal, and his lawyers handled the documents as I was sick. Which of my brothers? James Anyao. Ah! I am finished. If it is James, everything is lost. I want Tony. I want Tony, but he won't listen. I want him. Oh. I don't like the way you keep going about this thing. It's, it's, it's becoming rather, rather... Look, we should be thankful after all that, that your husband did a deal with a family member. I mean, it, 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 it's still within the family. What if you had done it with a stranger? If you had done it with a stranger, I would have been protected. At least I will beg for mercy and they will have mercy on me. James has no mercy. It's okay. He doesn't have mercy. Calm down. James doesn't have mercy. He Calm doesn't... down, madam. Calm down. It's okay, madam. Even if I wasn't the one that drew up that deal, at least I can still have say as a company lawyer you know. So relax your mind, okay? Let your mind be at rest. Don't worry. Look, look, Barista, don't, don't, don't mind her. I think she's just overreacting. And besides what with the death of her husband, the demise of her husband, it's just not being taken so easy. Thank you all the same. Thank you for coming out. God bless you. Anyway, darling, I think you should go in and rest. You've attended to too many people today, okay? Thank you, Barista. God bless you. I I don't understand this document I just read. Well, um it goes like this. In order for us to secure the loan from the bank, we need to merge companies. Merge with which company? We trans concept, madam, which generally belongs to Mr. Anya O'Hare. What? But I wasn't informed about that. It's a pity, madam, but it is the prerogative of the client, not mine or my client. You see, before Mr. Tony passed on, he actually made Mr. Anya O'Hare a co-owner of the new company, which is Dax International. And since he's no more, the saddle of authority now rests on Mr. Anyao as a co-owner, and I, the secretary of the company, to actually execute these plans. Hey! God, God, why? Why? Madam, don't cry. Aren't you lucky that the partner is a blood relative? At least you stand a chance to be protected. Uh, Madam, um, leave uh, 
Me give us some. Just have to excuse her, I'm so sorry. Um, you know, the death of her husband is still affecting her. So it's not her fault. Okay. Mm. I guess we'll put this meeting to an end. What, what do you say, sir? Oh, yeah, I propose the closure of this meeting. It's no problem. So, the long and short of the whole story is that James is the new owner of the company. James? How can I get it out of James's hand? I didn't get you. What do you mean, how can you get it out of his hand? I don't understand you. What do you mean? Look, I really don't get this. Why is it that any time we, we are talking about family issues and we mention James's name. He just seemed to like flare up. You keep making him look like he was a devil or something. Because that is exactly what he is. A leopard can never change its Oh, thoughts. stop it. Stop it, Mary. Stop it right here and now. I don't like this. He's just creating this big wall of enmity. Okay, let me ask you. You want to run the company? Mary, do you have the slightest idea of what it means to run the affairs of the company. You are blind. You can't see past his pleasant demeanor to see the greed, the ruthlessness of his true person. To see the greed and ruthlessness. Uh, Mary. See, I want to tell you people something. In fact, this is the best time to say it. For so long, I've tried to reconcile with my sister Mary. But all that I've gotten from her, from my effort, has been insult and rejection. Well, enough is enough. Enough is enough. I am true trying to make it up. So you and any other person who thinks otherwise should go to hell. James, I will not sit down here and listen to all that balderdash. I will not have you insult the whole family. What's all this anyway? For Pete's sakes, your sister, your kid sister, has just lost her husband. And this is all you have to offer. <laughs> Mary, my sister. Mary, that I've said it with her own mouth that I've ceased to be her brother. I don't care. I will say it again and again and again. I don't care. You succeeded in killing Papa, and now you have killed my husband. Mary! Mary! Me stupid. I took it. Call me thief. I took it. Call me Satan. I took it. And now you just called me a murderer. That I will take. Goodbye. James. James! James, I'm talking to you! So, my dear sister Mary, you see what you have done? You've let your brother walk out. You made him feel so bad. Mary, what's wrong with you? Let, let, let me ask you. Do you honestly, do you honestly think that if James had a good mind to help you, he still would? Look, it, it's 
not Why like I, I, I'm, I'm not saying. I'm not. I'm not. Look, Mary, I'm not saying I that. You must not go. Leave me alone, anytime. I could not talk then because I had no money. We are all turning the oh, I cannot oh, say my I, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Look, what I did to you was unfair. But that's not the way to go about it. Okay, okay, okay. Look, okay. We're supposed sorry. to be I'm the sorry. people oh, of this community. I am sorry. I... Okay. You are more educated, more exposed, and more enlightened. I don't know. But I don't need to be more than you. You are but breaking my heart. What can I do? Already, we're stalling. I don't have money or even the connection to fight him. What do you do? you want to fight for your rights? Of course I do. Then if you're ready, I have the money and the connection to put you through. I just want a yes or no answer. Of course, I'm ready to fight if you support me. Ah, yes. Uh, anyway, we'll have a deal. Let's proceed. Look at what I want you to do for me. I want you to tell your brother to give me a title. I, James, want a chief title. Title? Mm -hmm. What does it get to do with my taking my throne? Martin, look, you need a titled man to be your spokesman. And I cannot be your spokesman without being a title holder. So I can talk on your behalf when. Quite strange. I uh, hope sir, no you call, and this is quite strange. That's no problem. I hope there's no problem. As a matter of fact, it's very important. That's no I'm problem. Obvious. As a matter of fact, it's very what important. What if you just I'm obvious. 
What if you just had 10 million naira? Is that a return question? Well, let me put it more direct. What if I offer you 10 million naira? 10 million naira? What do I have to do? Sell my mom? Oh, not in the oblique. Um, all I want you to do is to look the other way. I still don't understand what you're talking about. Well, the goods are being disposed. Your court is ten million naira. Take it and keep quiet, or take a vacation. Don't tell me you're trying to deprive your sister from having her own share. What do you mean? What kind of share are you talking about? I mean, what did she do that she wanted to have a share? Is it because she's married to him? For God's sake, this is your sister we are talking about. To hell with that. I don't understand. I, I don't care. I'm talking about business. Yes. And as a matter of fact, are you in it or out of it? Tell me, are you game? I'm sorry. Tony is not just a friend. He was my benefactor. And I can't do that to him. Not even in death. So what's your surprise? Should we negotiate? My price. My price is, you take your fair share, let me have my share, and let your sister have hers. I guess we can't reach a compromise. No, sir. Not in this life, and even in the next to come. Uh. Well, I guess it may be your third word. Then we could talk. Uh, I guess I need a new corporate lawyer. We've talked about this for the optimum time. We keep talking about this over and over and over, and, and we're still not coming out with anything meaningful. Look, I, 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 I know she said some things that were really bad. If you ask me, I think they were that bad. But then, James, you have to give her another chance. Give her a chance. How much longer do I have to wait? Oh, tell me. Tell me, how much longer do I have to wait? Uh, uh, Look, let me tell you, it's over between Mary and I. As it is now, we are sworn enemies. And if I see anything good coming our way, I will say... Oh, no, 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 that, that, that's a very wrong thing to say. That's a very wrong thing to say. Look, James. This young man we're talking about is our sister. How many times do I have to keep telling you that, that we're talking about our sister? Yes. Yes. Call me whosoever you are. Please call me. Good afternoon, gentlemen. Yes, good afternoon. How may we help you? I am Inspector Erika Amanu, and this is my partner, Antonio Koro. We are from the state CID. Who is Mr. Stanley Ayam? Yes, I am Mr. Anyao. You are under arrest for the murder of Barista Asia. What? Me? No, no. Look, I, I, think, I think you've got the wrong man. 
you have a right to remain silent as anything you say or do can and shall be used against you in a court of law. Man, this is some sort of joke. Look. Look, look. take care, Mr. Hall. Look, look. No, no, it's okay, it's okay. Are you coming with us or do you Stand want up. to compound your problem by resisting arrest? No, we're it's not going to be okay. Take it easy. Mr. Man, stand up. Please, take don't, it easy. don't rough handle Oh, my God. Uh, 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 uh. Take him, Sergeant. Wait, Stanley, um, you go with them. I, I, I'm coming with you. Uh, I better let me call my lawyer. Man, this is crazy. Let's go. You're wasting my time. Do you have a cell phone with this number 080-33-79-044-09? That's my number. Can I see it? Hey, uh, officer, is that supposed to be an ex-beat or what? <laughs> Mr. Man, if you allow me to carry out my investigation, it will save both of us time. But it's my brother and I have to make sure he's protected. Talking about protection, why should an innocent person need protection from the law? What is it supposed to be a friend, you know? Uh, well, um, you understand it? It seems to your phone. But let me warn you. Make sure you don't tamper with the test on this phone. Because if you do, I will arrest you for tampering with the evidence and also for trying to pervert the course of justice. So read it loud. Barrister, it's me, Stanley, Mary's elder brother. Please, can you come to the abandoned water project? No, no, no. It's urgent, it's very important. Please tell me when you're, when you're coming. Hey, 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 Now all this has to stop. I, I didn't, I didn't send that. I'm innocent of all these allegations. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you talking about? Well, I did not send that text. Well, we should leave that one for your barrister to explain and also for the judge to decide when we get to court. Meanwhile, I am detaining you till I complete my investigation. What? Is Detain that, me? Uh, uh, officer, can't I arrange for his bail? A case that has to do with the loss of life and limb. The Constitution says that he will not be granted bail. Look, you're talking to an innocent man here. All these are false allegations. I don't even know what you're talking about. Stanley, you know what happened? Don't worry, I'm going to get my lawyer. And I think he's in the best position to take care of this case. Are you saying you're going to leave me here? Stanley, both of us cannot be here. No one person has to be up and doing. No, James, both of us have to leave here. I me, I'm going to die. Stanley, I mean, I have to call my lawyer. I am not a lawyer. I, I mean, he's in the best position to take care of this case, Look, to bring you out from here. James, I'm like, I can't stay here either. You want me to die here? The two of us can't stay here either. Let me go and get my lawyer. He's in the best position to get you out from this place. I'm not a lawyer. It was there yesterday when he sent her a test, thanking her for the help. I'm not inviting her for the meeting. That would be most difficult, you see, because the exact spot he tested her to go was the exact spot that she was killed. Ma, 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 no, 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 at all. See, it can't happen. I don't care whatever it takes or how much it costs. My brother can never be punished for what he did not do. Hey, Barista, we don't have mothers in our family. God. Mm -mm. You see, James, 
that will be a very hard case for us. You see, the only advantage we have is the motive. Because there was no motive in the content of the test he sent to her to what her death. So how do we proceed? Um, I believe there's no fact denying sending her test, you know. Uh, because it was his number that was on her phone. And that one can never be argued, you see. But uh, I still believe that we can own up to have sent her a test, but having forgotten to go for the meeting. But what is the reason for this meeting? What is the reason for this meeting? For this meeting? What is the reason for this meeting? <sighs> okay. Okay. We will see tomorrow. Let me prepare my defense. Okay. It's no problem. Oh well, um, the lawyer says that it's going to be a very difficult case. So as it is, I mean, we need to gather a lot of money together. Besides that, the business, I mean, the deal is not coming up as I would want. So I don't know. How much is he asking for? Mm, he wants half a million naira as a retainer. You know, uh, I, I don't want, I, I wouldn't want us to lose this business. So we have to retain him. Half a million? What do you mean? Is it not worth freeing our senior brother? How, how, how do you expect me to get that kind of money? If I retain that money for my business, it will affect me badly. Choice is yours. Um, you can talk to Mary. Tell her to contribute. Left to me, I mean, she better pack her, pack her from the house. Pack out? Why? Of course. If you don't know, let me tell you. Her husband used that house as a collateral. And since the business is delaying, we have to sell something to relieve the interest that we have to pay. Besides, Mary is a widow. And the, as a matter of fact, what, I mean, what does she need a big house for? It's not as if she has children or something. Do you understand me? Well, for that, I have to think about it very well before discussing it with Mary. Well, I have to go. So when is the lawyer, when, when is he expecting the, when, when are we supposed to give the lawyer money? Well, like you said, our brother's freedom is worth more than the sacrifice. Oh, half a million. I don't know. If you are true, let me know. You know the better. No. I understand every bit of what you said. But let's look at it this way. I have money more than he does. <laughs> I can sell to you people more than he can. I can equally buy a car for each of you if you support me. Mm. 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 Young James. Ah, uh, no. Kill him. You have failed to see where we are coming from. You see, he has been of a great assistance to the community for a while now. We feel he has paid his dues. And besides, you are not a tattooed man. Mm -hmm. And that is the point. <clears throat> Um, how much does did he pay? Uh, 
No, tell me, because I'm ready to, to double it. It is not just about money. Eh? Besides, the Igwe has given him his blessings. So I can't count on you people help. Oh no, no. uh, well, I intended to give people five million naira huh? if you have supported me. Huh? Five? Uh, uh, no, uh, wait, wait first. So I will go with my money. No, 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 no. Uh, uh, Maybe you will excuse us small for this cause. You know, we elders must do things as the tradition demands. Yes. Okay, in that case, as I come back next week, maybe that will give you people an ample time, ample opportunity to discuss over it. But meanwhile, um, I'll give you people one million naira now. Can you use it and buy yourself one? Yes. Yes. Ah, Nietzsche, I want. Let me go. Why? Take care of Thank you. Hey, no. Much. I could not talk to them because I had no money. But thank God I have arrived. I cannot save my mind. What I did to you was unfair. God in heaven knows. Yes. You are supposed to be the Igwe of this community. Because I mean, you are more educated, more exposed, and more enlightened than your brother. But I gave it to him because he has money more than you. You see the game? What you say is the truth. But what can I do? Already they have installed him. And I don't I don't have money or even the connection to fight him. Machi, do you want to fight for your rights? Of course I do. Then if you're ready, I have the money and the connection to put you through. I just want a yes or no answer. Of course, I'm ready to fight if you support me. Ah. Yes. Uh, anyway, we have a deal. Let's proceed. Look at what I want you to do for me. I want you to tell your brother to give me a title. I, James, want a chief Tessie title. Title? Mm -hmm. What does it get to do with my taking my throne? Martin, look, you need a titled man to be your spokesman. And I cannot be your spokesman without being a title holder. So I can talk on your behalf when the matter arises. You see, that's the key. You understand me now? You have a point about what you just said. A right? very big point, my brother. A very big one. But what title do you want to take? <laughs> I get it, I get it. <laughs> you see, Matthew, my kind of person. You see, I don't like what people have had in the past and rejected. No. I want a title that nobody has ever had. I want a virgin title, the one that I can manufacture. I don't want um uh really got a two of her. Mm -mm. I want a fresh one, the one that only me can have in this our entire village and the environs I have ever had. But you're too young for that kind of title. Eh? <laughs> Martin, mm -mm. I have money, and money is a plus to my age. <laughs> okay. I'll see what I can do about it. Mm. Mm. Um, okay, you give me your account number. That's what you do. Give me your account number. I'll pay a little change into your account. And uh, I'll help mobilize you, arrange people that help and support you. Vote for you yes. so that you can I will come appreciate here. it. Okay. Thanks, sir. Thank you want to come and see me to my car? You are welcome. All right, you. I believe you. Well, um, no, you, I mean, take that one and buy yourself. Okay. A small cooler. Okay. Um, test me your account number, okay? Since you said you don't have it offer. I will. Test me your account number. 
I'll mess with you, Uncle. Right. All right. is coming up soon. I don't know how soon this soon is. James, it's terrible in here, you know. I need to get out of here. Um, the lawyer said that, um, that the judge that is presiding over your case has been known for dishing out capital punishment. And therefore, they want to transfer your case to... Transfer? What do you mean transfer? I've not even seen a lawyer. I've not gone to court and you're talking about transfer. No, no. They said they want another judge who can accept Ghana must go back. You know now. Look, James. Let them do whatever they have to do. I, I have to get out of here. If not, I will just die. Yes, I will try as much as possible to take you out from this place. I bet you. I will. Me meanwhile, um... There's something I want us to discuss. It's very, very important. What is it? People have been disturbing me to run for the House of Assembly. You? House of Assembly? Yes. But, but you know my friend Chidin Bazuriki is running for that same position. He's vying for that same position. And he already has the, 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 the blessings of the Igwe. Yes, the Castle of Edas. Um, said that he's not qualified. And they said that, 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 that the next person is supposed to be from uh, our father's, clan, father's lineage. Uh, as a mark of respect to him. How did all this happen? When did it happen? Yeah, they've been calling me, calling and calling, calling me. Eh? In fact, they, 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 they are about to give me Chief Tessie title. Give one. Mm. Chief Tansi title. Mm. James, mm. where will you get all that kind of money to pay for, for a Chief Tansi title? Besides, didn't you tell me that the money you were expecting had not materialized? I just got to know that it was um, Matthew that, that, that is sponsoring them. You watch it. Matthew? Mm -hmm. Matthew, the Igwe's younger brother. Mm. In fact, um, Stanley, you know, they say you were supposed to be the next person that should take over this mantle of leadership. Because we are Omo as a people, you understand? And uh, this is our time to produce uh, an eligible candidate for that House of Assembly. And because of your present predicament, your mother case and the real other things, uh, they say that I, should, I am the next person that should go for it. Well... Whatever is yours is mine. You're my brother. Isn't it said that whatever the mouth eats, the whole body benefits? Oh. Since you have the support of the elders in council and the Igwe's brother is supportive, then I think you can go. You have my blessings. But I have to get out of this place. Of course, oh, you will get out from this place. I promise you, you get out from this place. Eh? Are, you, are, you, are you comfortable? Comfortable? How can I be comfortable here, James? Don't worry. I'm going to meet that lawyer. Let me see. Take this 1,000 naira. You need 
energy. You need to stand firm. firm. You need fraternity. So, you can buy yourself mineral or, or, or of, of anything that can give you energy. Because energy is the most fatal thing we need our, in our body. Okay? Buy something and drink. Meanwhile, let me pray for you. Just get out of you get out of Jesus, you get out of James, where's my husband's money? Where's my husband's money, James? You want to use my husband's money to take title and do politics? Just one how? One how? Just one how? Did you give me any money? Did you? James, relax. You're not helping matters. You're not helping matters. Bustani told me your discovery. Yes, fine. But concerning Mary's husband's property, she has given up to you as you asked. But if you didn't keep coming up with one excuse or the other. So I'm lying. You are lying, James. You know you are lying. No, what she's trying to say is that when is the appropriate time for her to expend the proceeds? That's all. Am I God? Am I God? Are you telling me when is the appropriate time to, for her to spend the proceeds? Am I God? Is it my fault that her husband and lawyer had to die? Who knows what they must have committed and should warrant them that kind of death? Stop that, James. Stop what do you that? mean, help me from the answer of James now. I mean, you should help me from him, eh? You should help me now. Right, look, it's, it's enough. It's enough. I've taken a lot from you. It's enough of this insult today. Everything else today. You all can go together as far as I'm concerned. I don't care. Nonsense. I'm moving out from this house today. Damn you. You know, because I've finally disposed your brother-in-law's house and I've deposited the money into your account, minus my normal 10%. Well, that's good. You see, about my brother, I wanted to leave him there. Then about my other brother, I wanted to go and tell him that we need another half a million naira. James? Yeah? I know this is not business of mine. But why do you hate your family so much? No, 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 Barrister. I do not hate them. And I've never hated them. Do you understand me? This is business. This is business, nothing personal. Don't want to be an obstacle to my aspiration. And that, I want to render ineffective. And I don't want to know, I don't want to man what it, it may cost me. Do you understand me? And may I ask you, what is your aspiration? Oh, I only have one, and that is, I want to be the next hero of my community. <laughs> you must be a schemer. Oh, no, Barista. I think I would rather call myself a player. You see, um, I'll be going home to meet with the elders of my community. And if my guess is right, <laughs> I shall soon be honored with each of this title. Then, may I call you an evil genius? I think I prefer this name to any other name. What is it? What is it? That name. That name. That name. So, let it. me now go and do something. No, 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 no. Okay? All right. All right, see you later.
James, our son, <laughs> uh, we have discussed at length. In fact, the cola money you gave uh, was very, very heavy. Very, very. <laughs> oh, very, very. Uh, but what we think um, we should do is that uh, you should let him go first, then you go. Huh? Yes. Yeah, so uh, turn by turn. Uh, yes, turn by turn. Yeah, so that at least there will be peace. Yeah, yeah. peace in the Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now I should let I should let him go first. Turn by turn. <laughs> now it has become turn by turn. Yes. Yes. Exactly. Yes. Turn that is turn by turn. Yes. 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 Turn by turn. yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. oh, no, thank you. Well, um, I thank you for your decision, and I thank you for a very wonderful conclusion. <laughs> but I want to let you know that I am the man of the moment. I don't believe in tomorrow. I believe in now. Yes. <laughs> well, since you people have decided to come to this stupid and useless conclusion, huh? it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay by me. <laughs> but I want all of you to return the color money I gave to you. One by one. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. But but, yes. but what do you think of this? Uh, what what to hold you? Huh? Yeah. What? You see what I'm saying? You, you, they, we didn't tell me anything. You see what this is discussing us now? What? We are saying. Hey! I have heard your deliberations. I have heard your stupid deliberations. You've concluded, right? No problem. But let me tell you, if you people turn to the top my money, my color money, I am going to. Sue the entire castle of chiefs for extortion. And I'll make sure that the entire community and the entire world must hear about this. Ah. If I don't do it, then no, I'm not James. Uh, 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 okay. Okay. I said it from beginning. You were doing it. You said nothing. Wake up, what did you say? I'm doing your own share. What do we do? Take her aunt wants to mean anything. You know she's a woman. Okay? So whatever she says, you just keep it off. Look, that girl has insulted me a lot. She has insulted me a lot. She has no respect for me. So I have to teach her a lesson. No, oh, come on, stop it. She's your sister. So because the child cries a lot, that's why you decided to throw her out just like that. No. Now remember, James, the way things are going on right now in this family, you're the only one that is financially balanced. You're the only one that can hold this family together. You know that. No other person. So you know that. You know that, and yet, you are married, treat me like a labor. You could not even give me very common, 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 common support for my political aspiration. You say so, stop it. Of course you know we are behind you. Why I haven't done much on this one just because of my business? Okay, Stanley case has been taking a lot of money from me. Yes, you now see what I've been passing through. You see it. You cannot put yourself in my own shoe. You know, when I tell you people about this, you think, Maybe because I have money, and that is why. Stop saying that, okay? We appreciate all everything you're doing. Now we need you, we need your help in this family. We cannot just do without you, right now. Alfred, right. now listen. I want you to work for me. While Mary takes care of the house, I am going to employ a senior advocate of Nigeria to take care of Stanley's case. Meanwhile, as that one is going on, we have to tackle the most important one, which is my political career. 
you know, my, my coronation comes up next week. And that means everybody has to be up and doing. Don't worry, you don't have to bother yourself. While this, uh, the senior advocate of Nigeria is taking care of Stanley's case, then we can be doing my coronation, which after we can still tackle Stanley's problem. Do you understand that? It's easy. I don't believe what you're saying. Stanley, look, I have just told you all the mischief your brother has been up to. And you are here telling me it is not possible, so I am lying. I'm not saying you're lying. So I didn't say that, did I? What are you saying then? All I'm saying is that I'm not sure. For Christ's sake, Stanley, you're not sure that your brother is a cold-blooded manipulator and possibly a killer? Oh, stop it! That's what you're not sure? Yeah. Frederick, stop it! Frederick, you've known me since childhood. I'm not one to take all sorts of information to heart. Something I've not seen with my eyes. How can I just believe it? And for crying out loud, it's my brother we're talking about. You just wake up one morning to tell me my brother is a cold-blooded killer, a murderer. How would you feel if someone told you about your brother that way? My brother might be bad, but I know him. He's my flesh and blood, and I know him well. Look, I know you guys, you guys have had some sort of problems while I was away. You guys should just make it up, okay? I, I, I don't want us to fight. Please. You have to understand it. All right, Stan. You have to understand. I understand with you. But I wish you and your brother good luck. Has it come to that? Frederick, 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 has it come to that? Frederick, you're overreacting, you know? You're overreacting. It's my brother we're talking about. I heard rumors about your activities. Who do you think you are? Who was your father? If your brother, with all his education, could fall for your schemes, I will not. I called you here today to warn you that a child born yesterday doesn't chew cola. Igwe. Yes, I know. My father had nothing. My father had no money. He had no chieftaincy title. But that was my father. I am James Anyam. I have the money. I have enormous wealth. I have chieftaincy title. And I'm well connected. So what else? Shut your mouth. How dare you talk before me? You were the people unanimously put you on this throne. I, James Anyam, was among the people. So I think. I deserve some little respect. James, if not for your title, I would have asked my aides to flog the daylight out of you. You have no respect. I shouldn't have listened to my brother by giving you this title. It's my mistake. Yeah, just, um, you have to make a list of I mean, what it will take to inaugurate a new Igwe. Ah. Which of the communities, you know, they have different traditions. Well, um, our community, of course. Well, it's about to have an unfortunate accident. Oh, just so the one I've been waiting for is finally here. Why don't you excuse me? We'll continue this discussion some other time. James, James. Uh, how is it? Hello, how are you? Oh. Yeah. It looks as if you are in a bad mood. Barrister, I think that is an understatement. I'm in a very foul mood. Then I ask who is responsible. Is it Stanley? Stanley? Stanley Rodas 
are as tenders a troublous pig. I'm talking of the way. I'm Come doing it. What is it with Igwe again? You see, James, I have told you times without number that you should leave the Igwe. You, know, you don't have to be aggravated with the things that have happened. So why draw the attention to yourself? I, I don't understand. Barista, I want him dead. <laughs> Come out of it. James, do you believe that you are making people to start to suspect you? You see, by your killing of Tony and his lawyer, though that was understandable, it was pure business. It was pure business. Uh, but do you still believe in me that people are still suspecting you that your hands are in their death? Now listen to me, James. By your killing of Igwe, <laughs> you are trying to make them to make a point and to make their proof. You see, Tony and his lawyer's death are just business, purely business. You see, Igwe, my killing is just for pleasure. It's okay. But may I ask you, apart from the pleasure, what do you stand to gain? You see, Barrister, I will drown the Gwes younger brother. And after doing that, I will dispose of him. And I'll become the next Igwe. Then what is the profit business wise? Well, um it will interest me to tell you that. Our Igwe is a first class. First class chief. Because of that, he has very easy access to government house. And because of his status, he cannot be questioned. Nobody can investigate him. So that is why I want to be the ego of my community. So that I will have an automatic immunity. You know, you have to send their boss. And not only that, Barista, if I become the ego, I can now. I believe you are making a point, but I still think that uh, you should give, uh, you should leave the way alone. You see, because I know that plenty of your businesses are, are illegal, and I still believe that if you keep a low profile, you will still survive. Yes. There is no need making money without showing it off. You have to let people know that you have money. Besides that. People have, you know, always think that I am a loser. So I want to prove them wrong. I want to tell them who I am. Ambassador Dean, uh, tomorrow I'll be traveling down to the village. And I want you to prepare for me 10 million naira cash. I am going with it. If that is what you want, I'll make it available tomorrow. Um, let's not forget. Prepare our boss. They'll be striking very, very soon. May I ask which of the boys? Um, mm, let's use the boys who use on Tony and his lawyer. I think we can count on them. They are very much dependent. Yeah, yeah. It's okay, and I'll now proceed to that immediately. Of course, too. Take my leave. Right. See you. I'll wait for you. Admitted that he ordered the death of Tony and his lawyer. Now he wants to kill him. Charles, Charlie, Charlie. Forgive me, but all this does not make sense. I, I, I just can't understand it. It's our brother we're talking about here. Look, Charles, I know James can be stubborn and sometimes can be very difficult. Personally, sometimes I can't stand th that his um, stubborn personality. But to call our own brother a cold-blooded killer, it just does not make sense. It doesn't. He's our own brother. But we have to do something about him. Like what? You can just keep looking at him just like that.
Ah, ah, ah. James. Yeah. That Stanley you trust. I'm on my way to the village. I have a meeting with some of the elders. I want you people to accompany me. We have a lot of work to do at the office. Uh, uh, forget about that. Let's go. I mean... Uh, um, Charles, James. Come inside, uh. James, as you can see, I'm not properly dressed. I mean, we were just um, taking a walk, weren't we? It doesn't make out. Uh, don't worry. I'll take you back to the house so that you freshen up. I mean, let's go. Hop in. Charles, hop in. That will be Charles, better. That will be better. Why don't you take us back home? Charles, hop in. Go. You all know the purpose for this gathering. I don't want to take um, much of your time. I just want to be precise. This is Marty. You know him. I want to be able to make him the next TV. He's a graduate. Yeah, a graduate of um, Ago. What did you study? Physical education. Physical education. Thank you very much. You see, with his knowledge and exposure, you'll be able to fight for me, fight for you, and fight for every one of us. He will bring a lot of development to this, our great community. He will stand for our rights. He will speak on our behalf. Whatever the government says, he will come and interpret to us. And I know with him, we shall even have even development from the government. And my greatest happiness is that you people are kingmakers. The other four are powerless, as far as I'm concerned. If you agree with me on this issue, I'll give you people two million naira cash. Then after enthroning him, I'll give you people another three million naira, making it five cool million naira cash. Mr. Marty, I believe you have something to tell them. Any food? Two minutes. Sure. I never. I greet you all, my elders. You're welcome. Baby. Yes. The Igwe is my brother. My blood brother. But things are not going as they should in this community. But with me, consider your problem solved. I will make sure that anything that comes to me from the government, you all will get your share. And you all will have salary every month. I rest my case. I agree to all. Uh, <clears throat> thank you very much. Uh, you will excuse us for a while. I'm afraid of it. Ah. Afraid of what? Look, afraid of what? The issue is, will Matthew make us a good Igwe? Good. Simple question. Now, wait, 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 my brother. What is wrong with the present Igwe? He's a fair man. Mm. So, it is fair you will chop. Oh. Since he became the Igwe, has he been given anything? Oh. Has he been giving you anything? Eh? What has he contributed to your family? My co elders. Even so, let us call him and talk to him. Not remove him. Please go and talk to him. Will talking to him fetch you and I one, one million naira and the salary? You think that they will agree? It's immaterial. 
As far as I'm concerned, Matthew is the next thing. I know why I call for this country. Get them, offer them money. You don't have any option. I mean, throw that stupid man that calls himself the Ugwe of this community. Throw him out. And I'm sure they will do that. It is now that I come to believe that you are really an evil genius. <laughs> what are you discussing? It is like they are finished with their deliberations. Mm. Yeah. What? Yeah. Okay. Um, we have heard what you said. You see, there is one thing that is common to all of us, and that is development of our community. If Matthew will do that, you have a support. I'll do it all. Not so fast, Matthew. We have a list of our demands. One, we expect bad bone water throughout the community in six months. Secondly, we shall add more classrooms to our primary and secondary schools. Last, but not the least, you must equip the Clinic to hospital standard. That's all. Um, you will do all these things within three months. Okay. Yes. Any more? Mm. And uh, if he fails, he won't last eight months. Damn. Yes. I promise he will not fail you people. He will not. So, how do you intend to remove him? Mm -hmm. That is the problem. That is the problem. Mm. The village do not have uh, any problem with the present mm. Igwe. So it is going to be very difficult. Very difficult. Very difficult. Well, they say the words of the elders are the words of wisdom. God has already instituted that in you people. Whatever you say is counted. Nobody takes your words for granted. If you want him to be the next Igwe, you people can do it. Once you spell it out, nobody takes it for granted. Nobody, nobody belittles it. If you say yes, the whole community will say yes as well. And when you say no, they too will say no. But I believe you can do it. As for the money, my boss will bring it to you, okay? I trust you and I know you will, not, you will never let me down. Do you understand me? Mm. Thank you. I should take my leave. Mm. So what was the verdict? Just as I thought, they are at lost to get rid of him. You see why? I should say that the boy should strike tomorrow. You see, James, you, you, you have to be strong. You see, I'm very careful because I'm afraid. I'm afraid of this. Why should you be afraid? Huh? Why should you be afraid? Look, Paris, you don't need to worry. I shall make you comfortable. Or would you be comfortable? Will you become the legal advisor to the Igwe of this community? I wish that would come to pass. Uh, but it shall come to pass. Don't be a man of little faith, okay? Get inside.
This gentleman, how may I help you? Who are you? What do you want? Where are you from? We are federal security operatives. Federal security what? Mr. James Anyamu, you are under arrest for the murder of one Mr. Tony Ikeogo and Barista Ezani and the attempted murder of the ego of your community. And you are also under arrest for money laundering and drug peddling. Excuse me. You I... have right to remain silent because whatever you say or do will be used against you in the court of law. No, 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 officer. Are you sure you're not mistaken? Yes, I admit I am James Anyamu. I know that. I appreciate that. That's my name. Gentlemen, oh, please yes. let's go. No, 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 we can settle that now. We don't have all the time, shall we? Okay, okay. I'll give you six minutes. To hell with your money. No, tell me that, officer. I know you. See, I know you're chairman. I can give you ten minutes. Okay, I'll give you ten. I'll give you ten. Let's go. No, 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 let's officer. Go. See, I know. I... We are both okay. for those things. I'll give you anything you want. Fifty million. Name, name your price. Please, let's go. I'll give you twenty. Thirty. No, just name, name your price. I'll give you fifty. Fifty. I'll, I'll buy. I'll be complete. I'll lost, lost over 150 million. I'll pay you. I'll pay you cash. You explain